Hi, everybody. Welcome back to Borderlands 2. Listen, we're on our grind, okay? You can try to stop me from playing Maya. You can try to tell me it isn't worth it. I'm telling you, we're playing her until we get the win, okay? That Once I get a win with all these characters, I can I can do whatever I want. I can play however I want to play. Now, what I would like to do, what could be really fun, is doing a melee Maya um, with a breakneck banshee. But, unfortunately, the game hates me, and it doesn't want to give me it. <laughs> oh, man. Even so, let's just take some of this early... Uh, a, a bushwhack? I mean, thank you very much. Uh, a decent bushwhack early. Ooh, that's a spitter. I like those too. And let's just take the sticky homing shock transfusion bolts. It's... Maybe we don't. Look at that fuse time, brother. 2.8 seconds. Maybe you missed me with that. Okay, so... Let's make sure we're organized. Launcher, slot 4. Easy swap. Bushwhack, let's go slot 1. I think this will be Dece right here. Five points. Like, listen, I got all the way to the dragons last time by going this build. I'm going to keep doing it. We go right side, then a little middle. I believe that's how I like to do it. And then a little... A little left. Now, we start off with our bushwhack. Oh, come on, bushwhack. You need to be able to pump out a little bit more than that, brother. Not good. Not a good sign. This is not the best bushwhack in the world. All right, we're gonna focus on getting some Teslas down. Okay, that's fine. Bad start, but again, these guys do a lot of damage early. I mean, they do a lot of damage late too. Don't get me wrong. Punch, punch, okay. Any corrosive damage weapons here? Not really. Oh, ESP loader. Walk up, walk back. They do, they're gonna make the guy stop spinning just for a second. I've got a couple of Teslas, I'll talk them. Oh, you're inside the pain zone, brother. Not bad. These guys should be softened up a little bit for me. Not bad at all. Is there any heal juice? There is a little bit of heal juice. Thank you. Look, I'm not going to chase down these stalkers. Let them come to me. One of them's a loot stalker. Got to make sure I kill him. There we go. Into the zones. Really? Oh, I got a hit off. That's good. I need to stop this guy's shield from coming back. There we go. Not that his shield won't come back. It's going to be a little bit easier to kill him. Get a re uh, reload off. One, two. Buckle my shoe. What you get me? Is that a Slayer Terramorphous? Oh, it's so sad, but it is what it is. Come on, Bushwhack. Please. There we go. Yeah, out of ammo with that one. That's okay, though. We have this TDR. I can chuck it at these, at these lads. That's right. Get wrecked. Thank you. Gotta love TDR weapons, especially early on. Let's see. Neither one of those is looking that good for me. The Slayer Term Morphous gives us the bottom skill, so let's just take one point each. I don't see a problem with that. That's a lot of value. Corrosive spinny gun? I could be I could be convinced. Cooldown rate or max grenade count? Okay, cooldown rate on Maya is a ridiculously good relic. Now my last run ended at the dragons. We had a really good setup. We had a mouthwash, two pick, and I accidentally just do a magic missile and blew myself up. So, well, I didn't accidentally throw the grenade. I meant to throw the grenade, but I didn't. I didn't need to put myself down. Malawan damage, Malawan fire rate. I mean, if we're going Malawan, <laughs> Maya. I mean, that could be really, really good. But for now, we're chilling. I haven't got any game breaking gear yet, so I'm not too worried about it. I see that guy over there. It's a badass of some sort. TDR launcher. Why not? All right. Ultimate badass. Let's go. Me against you, homie. Chuck. Chuck. Keep chucking. Don't worry about anybody else except the ultimate badass because he's the one that's going to kill me. There we go. 
Go up. Go down. Give me that sweet release. Ammo's not looking too, too horrible, to be honest with you. We've only killed four enemies? How could that be? Uh-oh. Out of blammo. Do we take bomber? Meet my bushwhack? Not bad. Toss that down on the ground. Hopefully that'll kill that dude. If he spawns, yeah, this guy spawns another grade in his hand after I kill him. It's kind of crazy. Okay, put him up. Make sure I get this kill. That way I'll get the sweet release. There we go. Do do do. Do 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 do. You go up. See ya. Sweet release me. Not bad. Oh, there's a chest back here I want to grab before I climb any steps. Alright, what do we got? A sniper. I probably should be taking some of this stuff, but... Again, we, we just kind of get a lot of good weapons while playing this, this mode that... I don't realistically need to be taking, you know, middle-of-the-pack stuff, you know? Oh, that was nice. I can be kind of picky in this. We do end up getting good gear a lot of the time. Sometimes the first raid boss can be a little bit tricky. Nice. Let's go. Okay, let's see. I do have a Malawan fire rate. I didn't even get a chance to use that spinny gun, but... Ooh, Jacob's Gatling gun. I do like the Gatling guns for their times three. Properties. Let's do. I like Flicker. I do. I also like Helios. Ooh, even got Cloud Kill. That's nice. Even got myself some Cloud Kill. Can I get to that one? No, no. That's nothing. That's nothing. I can get him good. Oi, yo, oi. Hey, uh, how are you? Alright, so now... Is there not a borderline symbol inside this hut? Loot tank. No. I manifested a loot tank in my last run, though. Torpedo, Convergence. That borderline symbol's around here somewhere. I think it's underneath me directly now? It's in there. We walk over here. Land on this platform. Oh, and a, and a pressure pad right there. Huge. Alright. Borderline symbol me. Let's see. Explosive damage and melee damage. Let's take the explosive damage and the melee damage one. And if I can get like a love thumper. Back uh, and a banshee. A breakneck banshee. We could be going to the moon. I should be giving these a try. I really should. But I can't try everything. Alright. Back here. Let's go. A slag overkill. To replace my bushwhack. Let's do it. Let's do that. The bushwhack gone. Slag overkill. You're in. It's a times four bandit shotgun. It's probably not going to do as much damage in one shot, but it is going to be doing decent de damage. Let's try it. Hey, 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 hey! You can all chill out. How about that? Let's just use this launcher for a second. So good against these spider ants. Oh, wow. That did big deeps. Later. Oh, don't, don't toss that. It's a waste. Later. Skater. Jump up. I see. I'm not going to go to the to the left, though. I don't want to get knocked off the edge. Let them come to me. They're, they're closing the distance. You first. What's nice about the, the bandit, the bandit times fours, is that you don't have to reload them as often. Just like that. Go out that entire segment without having to reload.
You chill out, brother. You don't have to be, you know, releasing all these toxic novas into the atmosphere. Don't you care about the planet? It's not. Guess you hate the planet. All right, bandit me. It's one chest here, one chest over there. But I like to get that chest in the downswing. Do I have an amp shield on right now? It's like a spike shield instead. Bum, 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 bum. Spike shield's underrated. Enemies that close the gap on you take that extra bit of damage, and I think they also get stunned. Which is a big deal. Okay, we have... I'm not saying that the Slayer Toromorphous is better, but... I think it is better. It's not that it's not the most amazing class mod. I'm not saying it's like an amazing class mod, but I'm saying it's better than those options. Open up. Open sesame. Now that is a slag minigun that could be fun. I think that could be fun. It's dull. Dull is a dull is a fun manufacturer to use. This could be a tough fight if I'm not packing serious damage. Now, luckily, luckily, I am Maya, so I can CC this laddie. This guy spawns in, and he drops. What's up, homie? Put you up. You're lucky you had a buccaneer spawn to, to protect you. Otherwise, I'd be pumping deeps into you right now. Hey, stop that. Hey, stop that. He's gotta die here though, right? Surely. He's got a million grenades at his feet. I'm gonna I mean it looks like I'm gonna be the one who dies. Thank you. Second like mix Moxie's crit. I had the chance to drop it, but it's gonna heal us up. I should have taken that class uh taken that cat class mod back in the other stage. And while we're on it, let's do it. Malawan. Make sure that the right one went on there. Yep. Oh, have we dropped it? We just gotta pay attention, that's all. What up, homie? I wonder what the odds are to drop it. Go up. Go down. Huge. Let's see, amp shield, melee shield. I mean, that's a decent fire spike shield. Well, let's grab myself some shovels. Shovel number one. Shovel number two. And who could forget about infamous shovel number three? I'm, I'm a professional rogue lance player. Simple as that. Let's see a lobbed merv. Again, we're looking for pretty specific stuff. Uh, take it for now because it's the only transfusion I've got, but. Overall, I don't think I, I don't I don't see a long term future with that grenade with us. Boom, 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 boom. Jump up here. Yes. Malawan reload speed, sniper rifle damage. Should take Malawan reload speed now. Well, I already have fire rate and damage. It's better than reload speed, depending on who you ask. Oh, wow, did I actually get something sent all the way over there? That's crazy. Oh, a Snyder with some sniper rifle damage could be good. Could be mucho good, though. Explosive Nova Shield? Why not? Got a lot of stuff to drop now, though. Constantly replacing my gear. Okay, we take a turtle shield. Let's go. Oh, let's get my reward. Okay, why not? I, I will stick with what I've got. We got this. Okay, now let's get research center. I think this guy, he he gets burned. Let's see. Five points into Reaper. One into Chain Reaction. Question is, does he resist shock? Don't see resist yet. Hey, get back here. 
Hey, what are you doing? Okay, that's fine. Damage is looking good with this crit, to be honest with you. Let's slag him back up again. That was pretty useful. Sorry, Cassius, but... Turns out to be a pretty easy fight. What'd you drop me? Overcompensator? Uh, it's like a baby butcher. I don't see it being that effective for us, but we'll take it. Oh, it's gonna talk to me. Oh no, I forgot. Choice move. <laughs> no! I hate you. Uh, let's see. A Pimpernel fire version. Okay, a Grog nozzle. Lady Fist. Let's see. Shotgun damage and reload speed. Deputy's bad. Good. Little Eevee. Let's just... I gotta focus here for a second, though. Primary weapon goes up top. Grog nozzle goes down. What's our primary weapon gonna be? For now, it's gonna be the crit. Next. Next, we go little Eevee. I mean, maybe we try a little bit of overcompensator with uh, Deputy's Badge, but I don't think it's going to be that good. Either way, five points me. And I like probably Helios over Emulate. Three, four, and then Ruin. Bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. I think this might be a box. I hit the box type round. Ooh, that looks fun. What is that? The Resolute Shredifier. Get okay, one more pull. Okay, actually, that's good. No, that's good. All right, give me a Plasma Caster, bro. And let's do... Just just... Do a little bit of each. There we go. Spread, spread, share the wealth. Plasma caster me. Oh, he did give me a plasma caster. Very nice. All right, let's go fight a raid boss. Now, it's raid. None of the raid bosses. It's really pyro Pete, man. Okay, none of the raid bosses um, get hit by corrosion damage that badly. So ha getting those weapons is kind of trash. However, a Mackie could be good. A shredder fire could be good. Oh my gosh, really? Okay, so what do we want to run? Cooldown rate, I think, is going to be good for us. Uh, come on. You against me, brother. Okay, let's just run away from that attack. If we stay over here, it's going to be hard for him to use his splash damage attack on us. Easy to dodge. Okay. I'm fine. That attack's easy to dodge too. Still haven't had to do... Oh, I did get hit by that. That's just not even wasting any time. Let's run straight over here. Spawn in some lads. Kill the lads. Juke. Juke. Ow, ow. Are you, are you kidding me? What the heck was that? And maybe one of these guys will drop me a power up. Okay. I seem to cleanse my debuff right away. No! It actually went away just in the nick of time to die. Okay. We actually do okay damage to him. Especially if you land crits.
Okay, thanks. Thank you, Crip, for dropping out of my hands. Appreciate that. Hmm, these guys spawned in somehow. Whoa, what if we get an anti-faction grenade? Why not? Oh, that's a big hit. That, that one hurts. That one hurts. Okay, we're getting down to below half. Uh, let's try maybe this Shred of Fire. Maybe this will do something good for us. Hmm, how much damage did that do? I'm not sure. I cleanse our debuff right away here. Fire away. Ba -dum -bum. Is that really doing much? I really can't tell. Now, my biggest issue is that you can... You can dodge his... Does he always do it in a pattern? Does he shoot these three and then shoot his... Yeah, I think I think that is a pattern. No, it's not. Ah, I still got hit by it. Shoot. You can dodge that attack by hiding behind some, some stuff, but... Uh, no crits. Keep it up. I mean, we're landing crits. It's just this guy is... I'm happy to get him now rather than later, but... He's a, a super annoying boss to kill. Oh, he's gonna... He's gonna... Yeah, he's gonna drop it to the dot. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Make sure we spawn in some lads. You guys are really gonna do this to me, huh? You really just gonna hide out? And right, we stay on the main boss here. There we go. One thing that's nice about Pyro P is that he usually drops pretty decent loot. The Slayer Terror Morphous is not good, but a Longbow Shaco negative is. And I'm gonna be dropping a ton of my a lot of stuff out of my inventory as well. Adventure Longbow. Hmm. I would like something else for a class mod too, to be honest with you. An attack seraphim or an elegant infection. I like the attack seraphim. Personally. Alright, let's drop a lot of stuff in my inventory. See you guys in a second. Oh yeah, ready? Boom. Um, okay, so. Let's do an anti-faction. Hmm. I think that'll be okay for now. I mean, Slayer Terramorphous, I already have one. And Burn Damage is the one I care about the absolute least. I think we're okay. We have the O negative for Grenade now. Longbow Shock O negative, which is good because it heals us up. Could be all we need for a Dragon Fight. I want to try a Hot Mamba, maybe? Oh, it's not a Venture Longbow? I already know what the Maggie can do for us. Let's try maybe a Longbow. I like this thing. Looks sick. Okay, Bloodshot Stronghold. Hmm, that's it's got a cool projectile. Very cool. All right, tier two. Let's go. Nothing can stop us. We're all the way, all the way up. Some legends are told about my Maya that was bold. All right. This crib is doing good work for us, but again, we could drop it for an untapped herald, mayhaps. It's not double penetrating, but okay, there's a better cooldown right relic. But I do have explosive damage plus thirty two percent. I'm starting to get a ton of good stuff. Let's uncap herald for a little bit. I do want to try a badass creator of badassitude. This is the beginning of 
Borderlands loved for the word badass. Like, it was cool when it was just the enemies that were badass, and then they started putting badass in everything. Let's, let's undo this and drop this 41%. And I want to try this sniper. I do have a Pimpernel. I know the Pimpernel is good. I want to try this sniper with a sniper, dam sniper damage relic. There we go. Okay, so let's start by putting this guy up. A Torg Rider. Okay, I'm not sure what the longbow did for me right there, but it didn't do that much damage. It's like it's like shooting a bow and arrow, I see. It's like shooting an arrow for sure. Iggy, go up, go up, go up. Okay, that's not bad. Oh wow, that wasn't bad at all. Oh my goodness. Okay. Aim for the head. Reload me. He's gone anyway. I see. It's it's hard to hit. But if you do manage to get a, a headshot, I'm pretty sure it's just gonna one shot. Maybe some more points into accelerate would take this thing to the, another level. I know that Excel oh muck and muck though. I know that the I know Accelerate kind of ruins the Pimper now. Oh, see ya. Maybe it's better used as a hip fire weapon, maybe? So that's no negative out. Later. Oh, I like it. I do. What's it called? The longbow? Yeah, the venture longbow. I do like it. You guys remember in the Borderlands 3? There was like a, um, a stream they did, the Borderlands official stream, and they had a co-host on it that kept saying like, I love crossbows. I love crossbows. It's like, <laughs> I, 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 like I, I'm for you and your love of crossbows, but like we get it. <laughs> You love crossbows. I'm back up. No problems asked. No problems asked, hey -o. Okay. Overkill or operational sniper? Again, just trash. Absolute trash. Let's take... Sweet release. Into wreck. Not bad, but not good either. Where is the Borderlands symbol on this map? I think it's back there somewhere. Is it not back here? I thought it was back here. It's somewhere around here, right? Oh, it's up there. Yep. Head back up. Again, having relics is a great thing that you can just add to your build to, to push it over the edge. Like, just having a sniper damage relic helps me with this build right now. The auto idle isn't happening. And where'd the other one go? Guess it's gone forever. Crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, crazy. Gone forever. Alright, go next. We always go next. Unassuming docks are potentially of little importance. We can get some class mods here, but the problem with these enemies is they typically resist fire, right? Yeah, resist fire. Kind of crazy, huh? Let's see if it even matters. Let's see if the longbow even cares. Uh, the, I think the longbow cares. Let's rock an uncapped herald with explosive damage. Make sure that they got the right one on there. Yep. Much better. Very nice. Reanimated skeleton? Am I gonna have to pull a sword out of him? No. Well, that's nice. Hey, go up. Go down. Honestly, I kind of feel like having cooldown reductions is better, but the extra explosive damage is super nice. Stop blocking all my divas, brother. All right. Kill the skeleton gladiator. All these guys resist fire. 
Unkept Herald, though. So good, man. I wish it was double penetrating, but it is what it is. I think it's good even without it. You. Not bad, not bad. All right, let's hit up all these chests. Because we can get access to a... Tiny Tina class mod here. And the Borderlands symbol is around here somewhere. It's like on the side of one of these buildings. Yeah, right there. Okay, there's Mouthwash. If we get Toothpick, I'm, I'm down to run it back. Definitely down to run it back. No class mods in that one. Crazy good. I, I got one there. I, I... Not the most efficient... Um... Opening of these, but that's okay. Righteous TMP or Bolshi Droog? Well, the, the Droog, obviously. Alright, let's take Wreck. And some points into Accelerate. Eleven. Trash. Absolutely garbage. But I believe in that chest right there. This chest is gonna have a I don't I don't know what it would be that would be better than what I've got. Man, again, if I was playing someone like Salvador, and I've said this before, if I was playing someone like Salvador or Gage that really likes these class mods, I would be upset. Getting that map and not getting a single one. That's tough. I, let's just stick with their explosive damage for now. It's not it's not doing us dirty at all. In fact, it's been pretty effective. Gotta get a little bit closer to make it effective. There we go. Not bad. What did you drop me? Super Spiker. Hey. Now, I do have a Corrosive Plasma Caster if I need it. go i go down but it's not that big of a deal hopefully yep let's get some sweet release going on this laddie there we go and the round's over clean clean as a whistle a boss rifle i wonder how good it would be against bosses accelerate suspension what you get me might of the seraphs i think it gave me one more that i missed Don't want Might of the Saris, bro. It's gonna get dropped. The one thing that I would love to be added to this game is just infinite bank slots. And this this character isn't for a long term, right? It's a short term character. I, I, I just want infinite inventory. That would be just a super nice change. Like, like the most annoying thing for me right now is the having to go. Is it if it's Oni? I'm pissed. Okay. Is having to go into my inventory and clear it out a whole bunch. For the regular game, I get it. It's like a it's a journey, it's an adventure. But for for Rogue Lands, it, just, it doesn't have any. I don't think it has any any merits to have to continuously go into inventory and drop stuff. Iridium, that's very nice. Jump up here. What do you got for me? Nothing I won't. Yo, I'm not going cat class mod right now because I really don't have an SMG that sends me out off the off the edge in a good way. That moves the needle, I should say. Okay, so this fight is a little bit tough because the big lad that, that comes out. We're going to toss that to, to get Watt down. Or we're going to phase lock the other laddie to let us get some alone time with Watt. And bada bing, bada boom. Okay, there is a love thumper. Golly, man. Breakneck Banshee class mod. Oh, imagine. SMG gun, gun damage is good. A love thumper plus backdraft is something that I've really thought about. Either way, let's keep it going. Mm. Yeah, let's, let's do killing enemy causes our shield to regenerate. 
And we can just go next. I'm not going to shoot up all the... Shoot the last mask. And, I mean, maybe I should have, but we're pushing. All right, Scorch. Me against you, brother. You see that Seraphim damage? Pretty nice, huh? And this is... This is looking okay. One, one thing I really like about Rogue Lands Mini is that you get access to some good weapons. Okay, pistol damage. It's not going to be better than my explosive damage one. However, if we do get a different pistol that we are running, then it will be better. So maybe this is the wrong way to give the Pimpernel a chance. I, I, I'm not going to rule it out, but I'm not too sure. And we have points in Accelerate, which might make it a little bit worse. We already fought Pyro Pete, which is a huge positive. Huge, huge positive. Who else are we afraid of? I mean, we would like to get Terramorphous, but Terramorphous has been killing me too recently. So, I mean, my last fight against him went really, really well. With a beast shield and a toothpick. But. I don't expect all my fights against Terra to go that well. All right, you go up, you go down. Now right, we got Scorch. Come here, brother. Scorch is one of the easier fights, I feel like. I'm gonna say that and he's gonna kill me. But like, this guy doesn't even do damage, like, pretty easy to kill. Especially if you get behind him like this. Pretty simple, pretty darn simple. Now, it doesn't drop anything good, at least this time, but... Okay, Magic Missile is how I died last time. Nice. Maker's a good shoddy. Scorpio. I'm good with that. Cherimay is healing. I'm just a little bit nervous. Take some more shield stuff and some action skull cooldown. There's too many guns to try, honestly. We're done trying that sniper. The sniper was fun. Now, I think maybe we hit box because if we can get toothpick and or B shield, neo generator, black hole. We we slap on the neo generator for sure. Let's see, we got a Ogre and a Baby Maker. Come on now. Let's see, Gunnerang and Thunderball Fist. 81. Class mod, sick. Legendary Siren, perfect, an upgrade. Let's go. And now, give me a Plasma Caster, brother. Let's do a mixture, just like last time. Nice. Oh, he did give me a plasma caster. Okay, I gotta manage, manage my inventory. I'll be back in a second. All right, y'all ready? Didn't get rid of all that much stuff, so it might be still struggling here for a little bit, but that's okay. Let's go next. Hopefully, we can get Terra. I think I have enough healing. I feel comfortable. Okay, it is gonna be. It is gonna be a tougher enemy. Now, we don't need any of these weapons for now. Let's rock. Plasma Caster. I like the Ogre as well. This should be fine. Neo Generator, Magic Missile. I have a Grog Nozzle, correct? I do. Let's slap a Grog Nozzle out here. Okay, shoot him once. I'm not sure how much damage I have to do to him, but I'm not, I'm not too concerned about killing him instantly. We can just rock this. Oh yeah, I can also I can also pull these guys in closer. I'm not sure how much I want to do that, but okay, not bad. I gotta think about what I'm using here. Yeah, explosive damage. No, no, no. How about Malawan damage and fire rate? Since you know it is a plasma caster, this one is a Malawan for sure. Don't let Hyperus hit me. Okay, 
There we go. Just just enough to get him started back up again. Okay. Part of me doesn't want to shoot into that pack because of how much... Because of the deflect chance. Like, the, I'm de they're deflecting my shots back at me. But... I think the splash damage will be good. Keep it going. Yeah, see that? I'm damaging myself quite a bit. There we go. To swap to the Grog every once in a while. Come on, brother. I just need to do enough. Just enough to get him to put his shield back up. I don't have to one-shot him or anything. I can kill him later. Okay, man, just missile these laddies. Decent, decent fight right now. Throw a magic missile. Not bad at all. Nice. These guys are definitely dying. Huge, huge. All right, final one going down now. Okay, so now I don't have to use any of these corrosive damage weapons anymore. I can just run this attack damage seraphim. This fire damage seraphim, I mean. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, we must be down right there. That would have been bad. Juke to the side. Looks like that's the same. He's got the same animation as uh, High Repeat when he does that, I feel like. Slamming the ground. There we go. It's just scroll. It's scroll up once for the Grog. Scroll back down for the Seraphim. There we go. Dang, this guy does not want to stay slagged at all. Ooh, close, close. Oh, it's Magic Missile out. Right, so maybe something... I don't know. Does he resist explosive damage? Let's try it. Let's try an ogre. Okay, hit him with that. Definitely is not resisting. Yep, yeah, that's not. He's not resisting at all. Huge. Alright, what did we get? An Ahab or about the Seraphs? We're taking Ahab. I don't really like the Ahab though, in general. Might of the Seraphs? Nope. Devastator? Says, says, hail. Hmm, will this put me down if I use it? I haven't really heard of it, and I, and I have never gotten it before, I don't think. We can try it, though. Man, kind of L loot, to be honest with you. An Avenger. This one, when I toss it, 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 it does that, right? Yeah. I mean, I personally don't. I never understood the damage of that. It doesn't seem like it does very much. That's just me, though. We can do this. Good. It's my favorite um, mini game because I can finish it in like half a second. But the first time, let me tell you, it was difficult. Again, I don't know exactly what gear I want to be using, but honestly, I think that we're, we're pretty stacked. The one thing we would want is a toothpick, but haven't gotten it. SMG damage. We don't have one yet, so we take. The question is, what weapon do we want to use as our primary? The Grog is staying. 
Let's do... Let's try Devastators for a little bit. And then... The Ogre was doing pretty good. I really like the Ogre in general. Ogre over Cryblaster. I like the Ogre more than the Cryblaster. Okay. So, put this guy up. Let's see how this damage to this gun does. It fires two shots. And I'm not sure how much damage it's doing, but... This is, we'll continue to use it for now. That's not terrible. I mean, it, it, it is tier 3 one and doing really good damage, so... No, that's a that's a bad that's a bad drop. Yeah, it's a really bad drop. That's such a bad drop. Come on. Kill him. Yes! Oh my gosh, I live. Okay, let's not let's stop messing around now. Let's go. Uncapped Herald. We know it works. Huge. Is that guy alive? Huge, huge, huge. Now, what is this red thing gonna get me? Will that count for a short time? Huge. Oh, what a snipe. I hit F2 to hopefully you make use of this pellet count. Landscaper or Fuster Cluck? Landscaper, go next. I wanna make use of this of this pellet count if I can. Okay. I'm uh, being flanked, but without any visuals at all. Okay. Let's run up here. But first, first, take some cooldown. Action skill cooldown. And some ward. Why not? Doom, doom. And I don't think the build from my last run was good. Um, I don't. I didn't really think my build was was holding me back. It was more just the fact that I threw a magic missile in my face. And did the run. <laughs> the accuracy of this bad boy is terrible, though. Just terrible. That was awful. I right, put him up. Yes. Yeah. And when not every shot has to land, it's much much better. What's nice about this, the ogre, is that it only shoots one one bullet per shot. So it doesn't like eat up your ammo even though you're missing a bunch. Alright, go down, brother. Ironclad, more like iron bad. Yeah, that's fine, I hope. I hope. Please don't run away from me. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Yes, okay. Ooh, man, alive, brother. I need to heal up. I need to throw more magic missiles as well. A really good grenade. I need to be using it more often. Okay, that guy's just gonna go through the floor. It's magic missile, everybody. Run. Huge. Run, 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 run. Don't get blown up by something random. Gwen's head or Laco? I think Laco is good. Laco is good. Five more points. Let's take. I want some regen. So there. Next time we go even more regen. Oasis should be a fun map. Let's try the Laco for this mobbing section with. With a little bit of SMG damage. Ogre, you did great. We're going to swap you out for Lico, though. Just for now. Or should I get this model on Plasma Caster? A shock one. That could be fun. Let's see. Where is the Lico? There it is. Alright, come on out. I fell. That sucks. Oh, loot enemy. 
not the best deeps on that hit fire. Yeah, this is bad. This is very bad. Scroll up. What you give me? What you give me? What you give me? A black hole? No, I'm not taking that. Okay, just, just grog nozzle that, laddie. Get back to full HP. I need to find a, like a decent secondary weapon. Um, I like the Seraphim in general. We'll do a cooldown right plus Seraphim. Why not? Hey, you guys chill out, huh? How about that? And just use, use our cooldown reduction to help us out here. Can I pick the Seraphim is like a toothpick, but it's a little bit worse. Looking nice though. Doom to do 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 do. One thing I could be doing is looking for those pressure pads. If I can find a pressure pad, that could be what I need. Watch this, there's one right back here. Nope. <laughs> Dang it. How about right back here? No. Because on tier three, the pressure pads give you really good items. A chopper or a commerce, neither. So next up, we're going to do sustenance. Constant regening HP. That's huge. Frostburn Canyon. Who am I going to fight here? Oh, yeah. It's incinerator, incinerator Clayton. Clayton. Not bad at all. Gonna get swarmed, though, from behind. You go up. Now you gotta go down. Well, let's take a little bit of uh, fire rate and ammo regen, now. There we go. Dude, all these fire runs gotta chill out. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, just fire from the hip. A little bit easier. Come on now. I haven't even gotten into the main section. You guys just keep messing with me. See ya. Come on, brother. Oh, no mad arsonist? I can't I can't hit him with my fire damage. Let's instead hit him with the grog. A little bit of Lako action. Later, kid. Inferno Midget. No more. We got this. Drop down. Shoot, shoot that explosive barrel so it doesn't kill us in a second here as I run up on this guy. Incinerator Clayton. Meet Laco. He goes down. Nice. Let's go. Not the best drop, though. I need to get one more kill. Reload me. Put him up. Magic missile. Don't really need the magic missile, but... See you later. The legendary nurse class mod? I pass. For sure on that. Alright, now all we have left is a mini boss round. And that's it. Mini boss and then dragons. Gluttony Gulch, easy. Should be at least. I don't have an incendiary damage relic, and I don't have a toothpick, but I'm gonna be trying to hit the box for a toothpick, hopefully. Hopefully I can get one. Toss, toss. Oh wait, that's a waste. Total waste. Might not be the fastest kill in the world, but we're good there. Not bad. Noise to swap to Grog. Heal back up. Wow, I can't really hit anybody, can I? There we go. Not bad damage at all. Swap to Grog and Magic Missile out.
What I might do is actually, I could... Why don't I just anti-faction instead? Grog and anti-faction? That could be much better. Look at him in there. Getting roasted a lot. There we go. Grog plus anti-faction grenade. I'm all out though. Gotta be careful. Not bad at all. Carniv Car Carnivorous Waddle Gobbler. The vulnerable. Toss one more anti-affection grenade. They're all gonna get sucked in. They're probably all gonna die here. There we go. Alright. An ogre? Is that gonna be better than mine? I'm not too sure. Alright, what you got for me? Maggie, a Neo Generator. I like that one a little bit more than my own. I like that Siren class mod more than my own. Okay, that's where that's all we're gonna need, I think. Click my reward first. Absolutely, I will. Unicorn explosions. Sure. Very nice. We can go. I mean, we have an explosive damage. We're like, we can go unicorn explosions for sure. All right. Give me something good. A Becca and a Hector's Paradise. Oh no, a Madhouse. Mm. I think we got the guns to get the job done. That's the problem. I like the Becca though. Hmm. The Unicorn Explosion can get the job done. I'm not sure. Let's drop a lot of this stuff. I'll see you guys in a second. Are right, you ready? Boom. That was not a bad one. Okay, let's take these two weapons. Let's keep hitting this box. Come on. Really? What is that? Skull Masher and a Pitchfork? I mean, not terrible. Let's see. A Varuk and a Thunderball Fist. Those are kind of bad. And Infinity plus Logan's Gun. Okay. These are the weapons that I am that I have that I'm stuck with. For better or for worse. Number one slot is going to be Grog. Or that's going to go in the two slot. My primary weapon is probably going to be the Becca? No, I didn't even get the Becca. I got the, I got the Madhouse. Maybe it's Ogre. Maybe it is Ogre. But we need something that can bring down these guys to the ground. And for that, I'm going to run an Avenger. Okay. Okay. Cooldown rate is going to be good for healing us up. Let's go fight some dragons. We got this. Come on, please. This is what we need. We have what we need. Now. Let's let's drop let's just run an O negative. I'm not messing around with trying to do anything else besides an O negative. I don't need a magic missile, I don't think. Alright. Use this to bring him down. Let's go for the blue one first if we can. Okay, blue one first if we can. There we go. He's hit. Now we just use this ogre, and I'm already get, taking so much damage. There we go. Land, brother. I already hit you. I thought if I hit you, you come back down. There we go. I need to focus up on using the right weapons. Oh, swap, swap, swap. Toss. Oh, come on. Stay alive. Stay alive. Grog nozzle me up. I'm taking a lot of damage here. Stay grogging, stay grogging. Okay. If I if I I saw I swap off the grog for a second, I take so much damage. Okay. Oh my god. This it's just so uh, I swap off the grog for just half a second and the ogre wasn't doing any damage there anyway. I have to re I gotta rethink my strategy going against these guys for sure. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And hopefully in the next one, we can be a tad more successful in the endgame. GG.